they see? That's my question. What did they see? Hiram Edson literally saw in vision Jesus move from the what? Holy to the most holy place. But when they started studying the scripture, did they see that same thing? Question, did they see that? When they studied the scriptures, they read in Daniel 7 that a judgment was set. They read where the ancient moved from the holy to the most holy place and the Son of Man followed from the holy to the most holy and they understood that that judgment was not Jesus coming to judge the earth as we think it is uh, coming in the second time, but that judgment was Jesus moving to the ancient of days to start the judgment, the investigative judgment before Jesus comes. Does it make sense? They saw that the world was not the sanctuary. It was the outer court of the sanctuary. But that the sanctuary was in heaven. They saw this. Now I want to ask you a question. Is this what they saw? Were they shown in 1843 chart? Did the 1843 chart saw their disappointment? Now some of you may not understand it, but some of you will who are here, and some of you will who are looking. There are good men that are telling us in order to finish the work that we must see this. And there's a certain number associated with it. 2520. Is that what God showed higher medicine? Then what God did to lead his people to finish the work, we must follow. Those, and I, we did a study. I have a study of everyone who taught the 2520 before they understood the sanctuary. And then find out that after the sanctuary was presented, everyone who studied the 2520, who did not, uh, who did not reject it after they understood the sanctuary, left the Seven Adventist Church. Every one of them. And the only ones that remained who taught it before and who set the sanctuary and then stopped teaching it was Joseph Bates and James White. Both of them taught it before, but they ended up rejecting it and ended up starting teaching only the sanctuary. I have good men that I know and love that are teaching this right now. So I say this not because the people are evil. Men who are deep students in the Bible believe this, but my friends, we're not to follow man. We're to follow who? What did God do? What did God show his people to explain the disappointment? He didn't show them no 2520. This is what he showed them. Look what it says. It says, there what? What is only? Nothing else. So no, no 1843, nothing else. Their only relief so far as ascertaining their true position was concerned was the light which directed their minds to the sanctuary above. Thy way, O oh God, is in the sanctuary. We got to get in there. What did they see in there? They didn't see no numbers. It was not chronology that they saw in there. The 2300 days took them somewhere, but guess who they saw? They saw Jesus. They saw their high priest move from the holy to the most holy place. And as they did this, watch now. Council of Rising Editors, page 30. It says, The passing of the time in what? 1844 was a period of great events opening to our what? astonished eyes they were surprised at what they would see they knew the 2520 at this time they thought that that was going to take them somewhere but it opened to our astonished eyes what the cleansing of the sanctuary what number takes us to the cleansing of the sanctuary now I want you to understand something now transpiring where in heaven and what else did they see having what decided relation to God's people where so what they saw is that what Jesus is doing up there affects what is going on where? And they saw that what they're doing down here can prevent what he's doing up there. 